Hello there, I'm Steve Santhoff of uh, Atlanta, Georgia. I'm here in Louisiana with Ben Knockin. Uh, what town are we in? San Santa Santa Ma. Santa Ma. South of New Orleans. And Ben and I have known each other since the early 2000s. We've independently had a dream of conserving the alligator snapping turtle. And we've tried to partner up as much as we can, being that I'm not a Louisiana resident. Uh, Ben's built a pond right here. Go ahead and film that briefly right there. And uh, we've got uh, a fence that's being put up, or Ben's got a fence being put up. And I had some time off, so I was going to come here and, uh, and try to help Ben get some alligator snapping turtles to populate the pond. He's got about 30, but 30 is not quite enough for a restoration project statewide or in any of the drainages that are severely depleted. And uh, so I wasn't able to get a permit from the state because the fence is not up and because the, uh, the state doesn't really feel that a female turtle should be removed from the wild uh, in order to ensure the future survivability of a population. Yet anybody can take one turtle at a time and consume it, which is you know, culturally uh, historical here in Louisiana, and I totally respect that. But we've got to figure out a way to uh, increase the uh, population size here and, you know, the captive group and, uh, you know, for success of the entire project. Uh, we did get one turtle that was donated. We took a previous film of it before it was secure, but the turtle was donated. They were going to eat it. And over a two-day course of time, I convinced them to give it to Ben. So I brought it down from northern Louisiana down here and uh, we loaded it up this morning and it's an 87 pound male and we'll just take him over here in the grass There he is. So he's nice and healthy, and it's that same turtle that we filmed. And we legally obtained the turtle, and we legally transported the turtle. And I'm glad the dog's afraid of it, so he doesn't try to get, try to do some biting and get bit. But anyway, so it's important to have males in a captive population as well for genetic diversity. So just because we're male heavy on the population size does, is not necessarily a bad thing, but we do need some more females. All right. You want to start filling that thing up? Yeah. Okay. I'll hang on to him. Oh, I'll right. try to keep the dog away. I tell you what, I'm going to go put him up. Okay, you can put him in there? Yeah. There you go. 